Hello, I'm Richard and I'll be teaching you how to navigate field climate. First off, you need to log in using Eggland's profile. The username and password are both Eggland with a capital A. Once you are logged into the app, you will be brought to one of our station details. From here and from the profiles button in the bottom right, you can see all of the data the station is collecting. To calculate how much rain a station has received in a given period of time, press the blue sigma button, also known as the strange E, and enter your start and end time and press calculate. You can also view daily, hourly, and raw graphs of the rain data through the buttons in the top right of the graph. To switch to another station, press on the name of the station at the top of the page. This will bring you to a list of all the stations within the profile, and you can choose your desired station by pressing on it. By pressing the three vertical dots on the top left of the screen, you will be brought to a page where you can access weather, forecast, map view, and a few other tools within Field Climate. For now, select map view. Map view puts all of the stations within the profile onto a map, as well as displays some of the information collected by each station. You can switch what information it shows by pressing on the description at the top of the page and selecting the information you want to be shown. Your options for information shown are last communication, air temperature, soil temperature, relative humidity, solar radiation, rain in 24 hours, 2 days, and 7 days, and then battery. If you press the three dots again, and then press station overview, it will show you a brief summary of the information from each station. You can select what data is shown by pressing the gray box at the top of the screen and selecting the desired information. By pressing the three dots again, you can select forecast, which will bring you to the basic forecasting page. In basic, you can press any day of the week and scroll down to see the hourly forecast. This includes cloud coverage, temperature, rain, moisture, and then wind speed and direction. There is also three other forecasting options, including details, 14 day forecast, and medio agro forecast. To log out, press the three dots and select User Profile. Once you're there, press the Logout in the top right corner. These are all of the basic features you need to know to use Field Climate. Thank you for your time.